Chief will never admit to smiling. Okay, that is not his thing. He does not smile. You might not have seen Chief Derek Diggs smile often, but Officer Yvette Dominique says his smile did show up, especially here. It made him feel very happy to see that the kids actually were in a place that was safe. That safe place is the Police Athletic League, an enrichment program for kids in Fort Myers. I think one of my favorite memories is to see him sitting right there um, trying to play video games with the kids. Um, losing horribly <laughs> at that, but um, he was just happy to be there. I sat down with Chief Diggs last year, just a few weeks before he took a leave of absence. I love them winning their games. I love them winning their meets, but that's not the most important thing. We're trying to get these young folks to be champions in life. The chief championed his own path. A college quarterback turned police chief in Toledo, Ohio, making history as the first black police chief there. Then his career brought him to Fort Myers seven years ago. Keith White, the senior coordinator at PAL, remembers when Chief Diggs arrived. At that time, Fort Myers was in a disarray. It had a lot of things going on negative. Um, that in our community. Chief Diggs told me even though he was not chief after the 2016 Fort Myers Club Blue shooting where 14 kids were shot and two died. And I knew right then and there that we would have to do some things different. A list of recommended changes to policing later came through what's called the Free Report and part of Chief Diggs' effort to change things included better relationships with local kids. He felt that PAL, along with policing, Reaching our youth and giving them something positive to do would help our um, overall picture of what we do here in Fort Myers. Now that positive influence is gone. It was hard. Um, it was like losing a father, a father figure. You know, he, he always push, you know, always. Chief Diggs came to my hood and empowered me to do what I do. And I appreciate him for that. He is definitely true blue. He loved this city. He loved this department. And we are going to miss him. Shari Armstrong, Fox 4.